Peace be with you. Welcome to the group's channel message reading. How are y'all? Come on in here. If you're new to the group, welcome. Hey there. Hi. Hello. Thank you so much for your patronage. Thank you for your beautiful love donations. Listen, this is the group where we really get into what it is we need to get into. Okay. So I got an immediate download. I heard they are racing against time to try to switch up the timelines. These synchronicities that we're getting, letting us know that we are ascending properly and that we have a victory is something that they, meaning people that don't like you, um, people that are just having unnecessary dark energy, meaning by dark moods, anger, whatever, they don't like the fact that we are in alignment. So I noticed that when I looked at the stove, the numbers were backwards. Somebody wants to rewind time. Let me just tell you what's going on. So what I did was I immediately um, paid attention to my physical body. And then I, I cleansed the space, right? Right on time. Because I'm feeling good. It's like nothing's about to get in the way of what it is that we got coming in, in here good. I even noticed that some of the gang stalking has become a little bit more obvious by way of needing to be like a distraction, um, me posting a scripture really irritated two people in particular. And I thought that was really interesting. And I said, you know what? No, this is for the group. This is for the people that really are trying their best to ascend and or, you know, uh, work through these shadows. Okay. So getting grounded is very, very important. Protecting your spiritual body by way of crystals. Um, I know there's one crystal in particular. Onyx is really, really good. Tourmaline is really, really good. Monday is a really good day to wear blue. Tuesday is a really good day to wear red. Wednesday's kind of neutral, so I would kind of stay with earth tones, if at all possible. And again, this is just by way of the cosmos and certain colors that put us in position of power. I just learned that recently. Shout out to the teacher that taught me that. And so I'm sharing that with you with the hopes that that will be helpful. Um, Earth Tones on Thursday and I believe Friday and Saturday. Friday was purple and I got to remember Saturday. Saturday might have been purple. But again, intuitively you will feel. Let's just say that. There is really no way to mess up this ascension. Let me just go ahead and dive into this energy because it does require some attention. Because people are being eliminated. So what they're doing is they want to keep you back in those shadows. They want to pull you back to the shadows, okay? They want to keep you stuck. It's not going to work. It's too late. These people are working against time, honey. And now that we're in 2024 and the universe is moving in our favor by way of undoing a lot of that black magic, trust me, can you imagine the backlash that these people are getting from the universe? Can you just imagine all of that energy returned to sender? So stretching, breathing, being in alignment, making sure that you keep an ample amount of water in your body, spring water if at all possible. Cucumbers and lemon, if you can tolerate that, are really good to infuse your water with. Okay, listen, if you've never done that or maybe you have, it's going to give you a very serious euphoric feeling. Almost like you're high, okay? Like, ooh, that's what cucumbers and lemon does, at least for me. Licorice root powder is amazing for the kidneys, the liver, the bladder, the spleen, detoxing the body, moringa powder. Get these things in your possession. Those glass canisters, you should have so much filled up in those canisters that you have enough with a scooper so that you can put it in an eight ounce glass of water, something like this. I prefer glass because it's natural. That's not even 100% glass. I could tell the way my fingers are tapping on it. But all things natural, if at all possible, okay? Um, the powders, I like the powders because they get right to the bloodstream. They go right into your body. You can feel them immediately. Eventually, you will um, have a palate that can tolerate some of those. If you're new to herbs, okay, this is for the newcomers, those people that are new to their journey. For those of you that already know you, a triple OG, 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 please drop comments down below helping other people. All of these messages are timeless. So no matter when you join the group, I recommend that you start with January the 1st, okay? 
This is what I recommend. Even if you get this message and you join the group in June, go back to January, work yourself up. It is a work guide type of a group. It's the type of group that requires for you to do that homework by way of what you do once the video is over and with yourself. Y'all know my shuffle game ain't no joke. You know that, right? We still got commercial breaks in the group. What's good? So tribe. So tribe. Listen, let's go ahead and get into this energy. This good, good energy. What is this energy that I'm feeling about the people trying to shift the time? Shifting the time. What are they doing? What's going on? They can't change it. Show us what it is we need to see. They're still trying to do magic, okay? So there could be an Aquarius, a Libra, and or a Gemini trying to use this age of Aquarius energy, Mercury retrograde energy, and or the balance by way of Libra and energy. Even if this is not an air sign, they're wanting to use these elements to um, disrupt the timeline because our alignment, baby, is whooping that ass. It's whooping their asses, y'all. It's really nothing else to say, okay? The magician is here, love. It's the magic. We are magic. So somebody's trying to do magic on magic. Emperor, Aries energy. Somebody could be doing fire magic using fire, I just heard, okay? Or these could be literal. Apply what you need to because a lot of these people we left behind, baby, we're just going to read them by way of their energy. It really don't matter what sign they are. A lot of them tried to cloak themselves. They're uncloaked, I just heard, by way of us ascending to this high vibration. Heavy and regret. Somebody could be honestly checking out, y'all. I've been getting this five of cups lately. Whoever these people are playing around in this darkness, you know, we understand the duality, right? We understand that darkness is there. We all have a shadow side. We all have darkness that we can go into, but we got really, really comfortable in the dark so much that we were naturally, you know, called to the light, meaning the darkness was not something that you are afraid of anymore right there's no fear there and because there's no fear in the shadow it's really pissing these people off five of cups heavy regret baby they don't know what the hell to do what the hell why the hell what the hell they losing it show me the people trying to shift the timeline i can't make it up death in the reverse death magic has returned to cinder i told you this five of cups has let me know that somebody's gonna drop literally from doing black magic from doing dark magic i just keep getting abuse of power abuse of elements abuse of fire wind and earth somebody is using the atmosphere to abuse their power yeah death in the reverse also represents them not wanting you to transform it's too late though y'all it's too late nasty gossip same things that they were doing <laughs> yesterday <laughs> last year on 12 31 1 what was it one two three one two three things are in alignment 2023 they're still doing the same thing three they want to go back to this energy they want to go back to this darkness they want to keep this door open and the universe is rebuking them i just heard and blocking them King of Swords, I told you, there's gossip, baby. They run in their mouth. They're mad. They're angry. They are upset because your endeavors are taking off and because you are ascending. Oh, this is good. This is really, really good. The fact that you have faith, just that mustard seed of faith, that little tiny bit of faith when you were standing in the middle of what appeared to be chaos is now the chaos now that is consuming them. They want to change the alignment. Show me these people. Why, why am I picking up this energy? And why do we need to know? We just need to be aware. I told y'all. I told you. Six of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. Heavy on that Mercury retrograde energy. Something they did around Mercury retrograde to try to keep you in toxicity. Six of Pentacles is equal share, equal give and take. The universe is saying we're giving them exactly what it is that they put out. We're going to be fair here. They put out death. They put out premature death. They wanted to unalive you. They put out hatred. All things darkness, okay? And darkness is not literal. Again, we're all aware of dark and light. And this is what a lot of people you're going to see are going to try to come along and confuse you of by way of certain comments. For those videos that go out into the public, you'll notice that people are going to be in the comments trying to uh, upset the energy, clown and laugh, anything to get arise out of you so that you will change your course it's not 
happening. Not in 2024. No, 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 no. 365 days of positivity is a real serious movement. It is when we obsessively, compulsively, every single day come to this group to get encouragement, to stay in a positive mindset. When we shifted the timelines, they got shifted into confusion and now they're trying to shift the time, but they don't have any power to do so. I just heard they're out of time. Literally, listen to what I said, out of time. They're outside of the timelines. They don't exist. This is why they want you to see them. Hey, hey, see me? Uh, I'm making a weird comment and we're not responding. We're not liking the comment. We're not commenting to the comment. It just does not exist. We're not reading all of that BS and taking it into our eye gates. It doesn't exist. So they're out of time, meaning they've run out of time. They're being put out of time. They're being eliminated out of the timelines. They're rushing to try to shift the time, but it's not working. What you're seeing is just a little nasty little aftermath of what their little funky little energy looks like as it is going away. Six of pentacles, baby, honey, listen, the wheel of fortune equal give and take they don't like the fact that the universe is really giving us really good good you know energy today i was on my computer y'all and i was sitting up there about to tap in to something on my business and the thing just went blank black all the way i said oh whoa what is going on here the screen went blank honey as a matter of fact let me see if i can pull up my computer now that i had to restart it but when i tell you i could not access a website I couldn't access anything. So we need to be prepared, okay? Um, a lot of this internet was for certain things to connect to us, right? So we have to remember what we're truly connected to by way of the internal net, inner standing, right? Because a lot of us, obviously, we use this to connect, don't we? Okay, so let's just assume that the computer needed to... Uh, be updated let's let's just assume that but i thought it was really interesting and so i had to shut it all the way down it wouldn't pull up a website it wouldn't do anything okay so this is about faith this is about the fact that you decided to cut that ass off they don't like it they're still trying to wage war they want to engage do not i repeat engage and when you do you do it by way of using nature just release it and watch the universe back you as you're standing in nature saying your prayers, asking the universe for what it is that you want, you're going to start to see the wind change. The sun is going to come out. If it's really cold where you are, the sun is going to make things tropical for you because you are in alignment. It is it is feeding off of your energy, your inner God. A lot of your enemies you're going to start to see are going to be in hermit mode. They're not going to come out a lot. They're, they're paranoid. They're scared. They're, you know, it's a lot going on. Three of Cups, these are past people from the group that you used to hang out with or whatever this was. Okay, give me just one moment, y'all. Let me just make sure I got everything here that I need. Oh, okay, hold on. It's asking me to restore. So let's just restore. Okay, give me just a moment, y'all. There we go. Okay, so listen. So we're going to start to see a lot of that, all right? Learning how to naturally uh, do things using the elements. How can you charge your cell phone if for whatever reason we have some type of electrical wave go throughout the atmosphere and there's a power outage, right? Going back to the basics, preparing your food with fire, if you can help it, if you have a microwave, I would get rid of it. I wouldn't nuke my food, y'all. If you got to warm your food up, do it in the, in the stove. You know, try to get a cast iron skillet if you can. This is our time and they don't like it. We are the high priestess. Masculines, welcome to the group. You absolutely can embody the high priestess energy. This is very, very good energy. Show us these people real quick. Trying to shift the timeline. What is it that the universe wants us to know? Six of Cups, again, they're wanting to relive the past. They're wanting to open up these past doors. It's not working, though. It's not going to work. 
once we fully awaken to what it is, you know, we needed to awaken to based on what is going on, there's no way that they can turn back those hands of time. They don't even have the power to do so, not by way of numbers. A lot of these karmic groups, which you're going to find, have been separated. Okay? They have no power. They've been separated. Right? Meaning they're all like fighting for their life individually. It's like every man for himself. So if somebody's still doing work, they're doing it individually, not in groups because they're fighting each other. Page of Cups, fake friendships coming in. So they want to come in and apologize. Page of Cups is fake and false apologies. You will be too awakened that you won't fall for it, okay? Anybody trying to infiltrate your life, penetrate your life, come in without their without permission, it's over. Yeah. Let me tell y'all something. Let me tell you something. The star in the reverse lets me know that these people's wishes are not getting fulfilled. When I asked about what's going on, it fell right here by the will of fortune and six of pentacles equal give and take. Whatever they're wishing for, hoping for, thinking that was working in the past, it's not working no more. It's over. 2024 is it. And I just heard in my mind 2028. Something's real significant about four more years. So the next four years is really your opportunity to work with these divine portals that are open and manifest, y'all. Call it in. Whatever it is that you're asking for, whatever it is that you want to release, prepare yourself for these moon cycles by way of taking salt baths, by way of taking herbal baths for a sword. Somebody could be sick. Somebody could really be somewhere sick. For real. Unable to heal. Under judgment. Still trying to shift the timeline to go back in the past and reverse everything. Like, nah, it's a wrap. Okay. They're angry about these unions. They don't know what to do because love is really the key. So the reason why a lot of them did not want you in these divine unions, okay, is because love is the key. Knowing that somebody's loving you and you're loving them back, okay, means that you can break up a lot of dark energy. They don't like that. The fact that you're teaching your children things that you should have known at a certain age. They don't like that. The fact that your children are grounded. They understand crystals and herbs. Put them in front of those videos teaching them about the elements of the earth. Yes, as babies, six months, nine months, one year, two years old. My recommendation is to always watch the previous readings. No matter when you come in or when you join the group. Okay? As we grow, there could be some people that might try to infiltrate this group, but this is a safe space. It is anointed and or protected. They will naturally be eliminated. They won't hang around for long because they're going to be too obvious, which is the reason why I started the group. Everybody in this group should be commenting and or participating. Even if you are helping somebody else in this group, teachers, leaders, students, that's what we all are. We're all a teacher. We're all a leader. We're all students. It's equal admiration. The tower. These people are getting towers, y'all. Bad. Bad. All that negativity they wished on you, all that badness, all of that, it's over. What is it that the universe wants us to know? Please and thank you. The Ace of Pentacles is here. So there's good business communication coming through, y'all. Money is looking real, real good. Do not pay attention. You're going to hear all kinds of things. Oh, the banking system, this. Oh, this and that. The universe is setting us up to where a lot of us honestly might be living rent free. I'm going to be honest. If something happens to where the universe has to set, reset itself, we could very well be living rent free, y'all. I'm just being honest. But if somebody here needs something and we can provide it, then we need to do that. We need to make sure that we pull together in numbers Learning how to go back into nature. Cooking your food with fire, I just heard. Okay? If you got a barbecue pit, I don't care if it's cold where you are, and you can, you know, uh, cook your food with wood chips, that's a good thing to do. Cook your food like that. Go back to the basics. Grow something. Even if you just have a small plant in your house, grow something. There's a lot of uh, different you know, do-it-yourself DIY tips on how to grow tomatoes and carrots and plants in little carton boxes, you know, those egg carton boxes. 
Okay, I'm eliminating all dairy. I use eggs for other things like cleansing. <laughs> but I will keep those cartons, you know, for certain things like that. There's going to be a lot of projects coming up in this group too. Two of Pentacles, this is about balancing out dark and light. Okay, somebody is really trying to penetrate. You got some old enemies and you got some new ones, but guess what? They've already been defeated and they know it. They know it. This is the year that a lot of them are really honestly, and I don't mean to say this in a harsh way. Let me just keep it real. A lot of them are just going to drop dead. I'm serious. I'm serious because there was so much death magic done on us, done on you, done on innocent people, your children, all kinds of stuff that a lot of them are just really going to drop dead. Ace of Cups. Okay, this is the helping hand of the creator helping us. This is what the universe is saying. You're going to watch certain people go through poverty while you prosper. You're going to wonder how is this possible with the world going through what it's going through. I'm being guided to take that. And it is possible. It's absolutely going to happen. This is what the universe is telling us. When I sat down, I was like, okay, universe, what is it that you want us to know? Page of Swords, somebody's spying. A lot of spying, y'all. Okay, but here's the thing. They're losing a lot of their gifts. They're losing a lot of their gifts. So really a lot of what they're seeing is them in the dark night of the soul. So you know how they had us or at certain times of your evolution by way of your ascension, you were like, where's that coming from? Where's that this? All those bouts of confusion. This is their permanent mind state. Like literally losing their mind. Some of them will go into mental hospitals. Uh, what they're going to be surprised about is that mental health is not what it used to be. Behavioral health. Okay. A lot of them are going to lose their minds. Some of them are just going to drop dead. You're going to hear about it. You're going to get wind of it. Hey, such and such, you hear about so-and-so? Yeah, they don't know what happened. He just passed away like that. Like literally. The universe is literally taking them out. Taking them out. It's over. Show me what else I need to see, please, and thank you. Yeah, I can't make it up. Eight of Swords. Mental imprisonment. Mental imprisonment. They can't even attack your children anymore. They're lost, spying. They don't even know what they're looking at. What they think they see is not reality. Does this make sense? What they think they see about your life is an illusion. These are the same illusions that they projected by way of death magic. Okay, things to attack your psyche, your crown. Yeah, show me what I need to see, please, and thank you. Why am I feeling this energy? What is it that I need to see? They're still in silent competition. They're fighting with one another, okay? The police could get called on a lot of these situations, be mindful of new friends. Be mindful of new people that want to connect with you. Pray about it. If you do tarot, pull the cards first. Get grounded. Ask spirit about every single thing. If you need a reading, I'm here. 30-minute readings, okay? For people in the group once a month, I'm going to give out free readings. I will email you. Once a month, I'm going to say, hey, put your email down below in the comments you will get a message from myself personally saying, hey, I've chosen you or not. I've chosen you. Spirit has chosen choosing you because I will have prayed about who I need to give the free reading to. <laughs> so I'm going to say, hey, you've been chosen, right, to get this free reading and just be patient because the goal is that everybody get a free reading at some point. It'll always be a celestial being reading, high vibrational reading. Meaning something that you need to know about something that's currently going on or something that you just need confirmation on or what you need to correct. I'm here to co-create with you and or collaborate as we are co-creating with the creator, the chariot, okay? So the five of wands and the chariot is giving me conflict in the home. There are people that are about to have some type of like legal issues, Yeah, legal issues, spazzing out, outbursts, two of cups, breakups, unions, divorce. Everything that they wished on you, honestly, y'all, is being returned to sender. All of it. All of it. They're terrified. 
they can't take these towers. Why is it that I'm seeing this for these people? Why am I seeing this for these people? Yeah, they have no power. They have no power. Some of them are waiting on news about their health, about their stability. They don't know what to do. They're seeing illusions, seven of cups. They're imagining things, seeing things, hearing voices. Okay, this is not to negate the people that are going through the dark night of the soul. Listen, if you're hearing voices and you know that you're in alignment and you're doing the right thing and you're coming up out of dark spell work, then you need to be grounded and you need to listen in that shadow because sometimes those are your ancestors telling you something. This is why it's important to stay in a high vibration so that you communicate with high vibrating beings by way of your ancestors. All your ancestors weren't nice. This is why you got to break that generational curse. So stay in that high vibration. Sit still. Do not block your clear audience. This is for people that are just now starting out. And maybe you're like, oh my God, what is this? Okay, I think just re relax. Breathe. You are safe. You're okay. If you're clearing out past karmic debt from a past life, just know that this is the year that everything is going to be made clear. You just have to surrender to the idea of it and or put yourself in alignment with what it is that you know you need to be obedient to. A lot of you need to change your diet, I just heard. A lot of us need to change our diets. A lot of us have changed our diets. That could just be confirmation. I'm going to be honest. I feel like that's confirmation. Okay? Vitamin C. If you can buy the highest potency of a vitamin C supplement, do it. Shifting money from whatever you spend it on, okay? I remember somebody told me one time, you know, she would always come to me and say, oh, I really want to get a reading, but I don't have the money. But every time I talked to her, she was getting a value meal every day. Hey, girl, where you at? Oh, I'm over here at McDonald's. Hey, girl, where you at? Oh, I'm at Wendy's. Hey, girl, where you at? I calculated one time $600. I said, huh? My readings are only $88. So this is not about you know, the money, but it is in the sense that you need to respect somebody's energy. You need to respect their craft. She didn't want it. She didn't want to put her money towards that because she didn't see it of value. Right? Judgment. So your money, your time, your thoughts go where you feel there is value or they should be. strength and power who are these people trying to monitor what is this energy that i'm picking up who are these people please and thank you show me these people yeah taurus virgo capricorn aries leo sagittarius whoever these people are they are absolutely still trying to use some type of fire magic i just heard using the earth somebody's using earth and fire. Somebody could be doing voodoo using the earth. Okay. We are very, very protected. They're getting their ass whooped by the ancestors. Bad. 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 Somebody wants to just keep a door open on you. To see what you're doing. But again, where you put your mind and your time, where your energy goes, it's being squandered. Because they're not getting anything out of giving you the evil eye. We're too protected. Once you gave your ancestors permission to intercede on your behalf, your ancestors went to work. Give them their ashe. Stay in nature. Anything else we need to see about these people? Who is this Queen of Pentacles? Knight of Wands. Who are these people? Who are these people? They're being forced to walk away. They don't want the time to be over, okay? They don't want the time to be up. So this is why they're trying to shift the timeline. When I say they're working really, really hard, this is useless. Their prayers <laughs> are useless. They're not getting through. The universe is not answering their prayer. So they're working and doing all of this toil and labor for absolutely nothing to get nothing because they are nothing. They don't exist anymore. They're out of time. They've been written out of the timeline. 
They're out of time and they're not in time. And they're not in alignment with our, our, excuse me, timeline. Temperance, fallen angels. Fallen from grace. No joy, no luck, no peace. They're begging for forgiveness. I'm sorry. These people are crying, y'all. They're going through it. If you know what you went through when they were sending you all that energy and all that unnecessary spell work, if you know what you went through, just imagine that return to sender. And them having to deal with that energy come back to them all at once. It's the all at once, though. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's going to take a little bit more than spring water to fix up all of it, whatever they got going on, baby. Show me who's got this door open. Yeah, they want to reconcile. Begging for a new beginning. Begging to be back into your life. Because they know that you're a healer. They know that you healed from something that they did. And they feel like you know the way. I need your help. They're desperate. But they're still doing something to try to stay tied to you or something. It's not working. The more you ascend, yeah, they could be working with other people or trying to find other people to work with them. Somebody is really paranoid, y'all. You know why they're paranoid? Somebody's really, really paranoid. Because they can't find anybody to work with them. Three of Pentacles. The fool is here. Nobody wants to take a leap of faith with them. So they're paranoid. They're stressed out. They're weighed down. There's people that, yeah, people have distanced themselves from them. Nobody wants any part in this. It's a waste of time. Their energy is really nasty. Yeah, they're out of time. That's what I keep getting. Something that they're doing is not working. Anything else we need to see and be aware of? Universe? Source of all things? Anything else that we need to see on our higher self? Empress here. Yeah, they're saying we're protected. You're protected. We are the new leaders. This represents your head. We're protected, divinely protected. Something about a new union coming in is protected. Our friendships, our new family is protected. Two of Cups, two, two, two. That emperor gives me empress energy as well. Like a union being protected. Somebody's obsessively watching us heal and close out cycles. Yep. Yeah. I just heard these people are going to have a slow, painful death. Damn. The death is here. They're watching us transform. They can't stop watching. They're absolutely, crazily obsessed. Nine of Pentacles is a slow-moving energy. Slow death, torment, while still watching us because we've healed from things that they don't even know how to heal from. It's over. Still sending weird energies. What's the outcome for these people? Give me current energy, please, and thank you. Yep, they're liars. They'll never be able to come into the truth. They'll never change. Ace of Swords in the reverse is like a lie. They're not to be trusted. They're not to be taken back into your life. Yeah, it's a no. An unsuccessful attempt. <laughs> I just heard. What else do we need to see, Spirit? Yeah. Spirit said, King of Swords, these people. Continue to stand this King of Swords energy. Six of Pentacles. 
They want equal give and take. Somebody also paid somebody too again to do some type of magic. Baby, they don't understand. They just don't like the fact that the universe is backing us. I can't make it up. Look, this is all about unions. This is all about unions. Emperor and the Empress. This is all about unions. And the ancestors are protecting it. High vibrations. Equal give and take. Somebody's still out here paying somebody. <laughs> Trying to paint some type of an illusion. Okay. This is a king of swords. Somebody paid a king of swords to continue to do. Oh, excuse me. Some type of moon magic to drain your energy. This is what I heard. But we are really, honestly, the king of swords. We're the king of swords. Show me this person. Somebody's isolated. Whoever this king of swords is too, they're isolated because they're defeated. Show me this king of swords. Yeah, they're spying. Whoever this king of swords is, they're spying. Spirit says they don't know what they see though. They can't see what they used to see. Show me the king of swords. Show me this king of swords, please and thank you. Yeah. An ex-lover. Somebody that's angry. Angry, hateful, losing it. It wanted to come up like this, but it came up like this. But this is somebody that, mm -mm. It's, it's over. They're being forced to walk away. You know why? Because they have their health to contend with. They got their stability, their money. Death is on their back. So to try to continue in this dark energy, using fire and the earth, it doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Somebody from the past. Want to create a new, another shadow. It's a no. Hell to the no. This could be people too. This don't have to be a lover in particular. But I think we're very much aware of that. We're just not giving it any attention. Six of Wands. Somebody was trying to scare you with energy. Projection. This person could have a heart attack. Something with their heart, y'all. Because they're coming up as the King of Swords in the up right now, which is also your energy. But, you know, previously the King of Swords in the reverse is somebody really nasty and bitter, unhealed, like a dark heart, harboring a lot of anger in their heart. Show me what I need to see, please, and thank you. Show me what I need to see. Anything else? Anything else? Yeah, this person's sick. I told you, their heart. They could have a heart attack. You know, obviously don't want nobody to be like this, but they're blinded to it. They don't even see it coming. Somebody could just drop, y'all. I'm, I'm not even playing. This is their energy that I'm seeing. Somebody could just drop dead. Two of swords, they're blinded to it. They don't even see it coming. This could just happen out of nowhere. Four of swords in the reverse is the inability to heal. Sickness and death, something with the heart. I told you something about the heart and it came out. Confirmation. Yep. Somebody could have been hoping something for you to happen with your health, your heart. Okay. Seven of swords, sneaky and deceptive. It's over. Yeah. You already see it. You know. You feel it, you know, you see it. You could be having dreams. You're going to start to have dreams too about what's going to happen to certain people. Mm -hmm. Wow. You're absolutely going to start to have dreams about this. This is just spirit's way of keeping you updated. So that you're aware, not to react, not to freak out, continue to go about your path. Somebody's out of time. Somebody's out of time. Death in the reverse is death return to sender. Yeah, they just want to win. Somebody could, yeah, somebody, uh, this could be people in your family. You could be a queen of cups, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, somebody with a family. 10 maybe your birthday's in october okay 
you're holding back communication from this person. It's driving this person crazy, wherever you are. Or you could just be a mother or you could be a masculine and your feminine energy balanced. You know? Anything else we need to see? Please and thank you. About this crazy ass person. You could have a couple of exes. You could have a couple of people. People from your family, Spirit is saying, and people that you celebrated with that you're holding back energy from. This Four of Pentacles is 2024 energy. You will not go back. You're like, mm -mm, I'm good. Holding back communication. There's also a King of Wands also in the mix, still trying to come towards you. This is because also you got this Ten of Pentacles coming in. Abundance, abundance, abundance is coming in for us, y'all. Stability. If you had if concerns about your money or whatever it was that you needed in order to complete these projects, write the book, you know, um, start your channel, whatever this is, it is coming. It's coming. And it's coming in fast. So just start claiming your financial status has improved and just really start looking at those things that you want and or need in order to further your business and have a decent business. Because again, your business is aligned with your passion. It's not going to feel like work. It's not work. Yeah, it's not work. Wow. This is the message, though. I love y'all. Just as I open this door, let's close it. I love you so much, y'all. Welcome to the group. I'm really happy about it. All my information is down below. For those readings, they're always going to take three days, okay? Just be prepared for that. Right before your reading, what I recommend is that you get grounded depending on the season that you're able to go into nature, okay, and light a white candle in your own name, right under that candle on a piece of paper with a real pencil, you know, I am giving this person, you can put Neff permission to help me see what it is I need to see and or I'm calling out to my ancestors to help her channel the energy based on what it is that I'm asking. In those readings, it is going to be five specific questions. Please include your month and your date of birth. And then screenshot your payment. PayPal is going to be back up and running again too. And send that to my email. That way I know. And it's going to be three days. Okay. I'm also going to have a phone number for y'all to text me. Okay, this is all group. Text me and sometimes you can screenshot it and sometimes I can just send your video straight to your phone. Okay, instead of your email. So however you want to do that, there's a lot of new things coming out, baby. This is so good. Welcome to 2024. Obsessively, compulsively, deliberately, 24 hours a day, 365 we are celebrating ourselves and being happy, high vibration, good vibes. Honestly, in real life is why this debt has gone and returned back to cinder. I love y'all. I love you so much. I will see you soon. Until the next video, peace be with you.